Thank you. Good morning, everybody. I just want to say a couple things. First, my great pleasure to welcome the State Councilor of China, the Auditor Tour to Boston. Uh, we have a great deal that we will be talking about and already began last night with a very informal and pleasant dinner. But there are many issues that China and the United States are cooperating on, even as we have some differences that we try to manage effectively. And right now, particularly on Ebola, on Afghanistan, on the Democratic Republic of North Korea, the North Korean nuclear situation, on Iran particularly, uh, and on ISIL and counterterrorism, and on climate change. There are many areas where we are working hard. So we look forward to some good discussions today. And on another note, I might just report, we had a very positive step forward in Iraq today with the selection of a Minister of Interior and a Minister of Defense. These were critical positions to be filled in order to assist with the organizing effort with respect to ISIL. So we're very pleased. We congratulate Prime Minister Abadi, and we look forward to working with them as we continue to grow the coalition and move forward. So thank you for being here, State Council. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Well, friends from the media, it's a great pleasure to see you here today. In the kind of invitation of Secretary John Kerry, I have the great pleasure to visit this beautiful city of uh, Boston. And the purpose of my visit to uh, Boston and then to Boston is really to pave the ground uh, for President Obama's visit to China uh, in November and also for the, for the participation of the President in the APEC informal leadership meeting uh, to be hosted uh, by China. I think the Senate's meeting between President Xi Jinping and President Obama was very successful. Two countries have decided to uh, work to build this new model of major country relationship between China and the United States. Since then, much progress has been made in our relationship. Uh, lately, uh, the Secretary himself went to China to participate in the SNED discussion with the Chinese side. We believe that uh, we should continue to work together to deepen our mutual trust and to put our efforts to the major areas of cooperation while on the basis of mutual respect, we can properly handle uh, any kind of uh, difference between us. I think the Asia-Pacific region is a very important region. Uh, we need to work together uh, to build up even more cooperation between China and the United States in the area, because this is an area which has experienced robust economic uh, development. I'm sure that the APEC meeting will go further to bring about more connectivity, innovative uh, development, and to shape a greater future for the region. There are also quite a few issues in the world, as the Secretary of State has mentioned. I believe that in terms of climate change, uh, Ebola, and the how to address the terrorist issues, and so on and so forth, uh, China and the United States have a lot to discuss today and, uh, and beyond. I would like to thank the Secretary for his warm hospitality. I'm sure that our discussion will be both constructive and productive. I'm sure that China-U.S. relationship will be on the way up. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.